what's going on Taurus it's Deb with Goddess of the Moon Tarot I hope that you are doing well and I hope that this reading finds you safe welcome to Topsoil Tuesday so let's see what we get for you Taurus all right hmm maybe you're trying to have a reconciliation or someone else is trying to have one with you so let's see yeah, because you're not really talking to anybody. You're kind of just staying in your own energies with none. It's like you're staying to yourself. You're hermit on them right now. They want you to come out and play, Taurus. They want you to come out and play. But you're like, no, I got too much. I got too much going on. I'm burdened. I got too many tasks. Every time I do something, I had to pick something else up. Maybe you got a person that's depending on you for finances. Maybe you have a uh, child. Maybe you have multiple children, the ten of scepters. But we got judgment coming out right here. So <clears throat> I feel like something about to be balanced out. Yeah, see the ten of cups. I don't know if you're doing it alone. I might be talking to a single father because um, male energy keeps showing up in the cards. You take care of your children alone. The Ten of Wands then came out twice now, y'all. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Ten of Wands, Ten of Cups. It's a little heavy burden. Possibly you had, you know, multiple children and got a divorce or something like that. And now you're the person that takes care of them. I don't feel like the mother is a supporter. Or they don't support when it comes to, like, you know, taking care of the bills. So we got the Prince prince of Swords. I feel like this energy that there's people that's trying to see if you're going to do the right thing. Because the Judgment card did show up. So it's like maybe you had to go to court to get custody of your kids. Uh, maybe there's people that's trying to see you slip up so they can try to take them and put them in a the system. But we got the Four of Discs. So I feel like you're trying to hold on to whatever it is that you have that you feel is important to you. You've been working very hard and diligent with this king of discs right here. There's going to actually be a new beginning that's going to come with the ace of wands. Maybe a new partner that's going to come to help you. And it's going to allow you to be able to have like escape and get away from the tumultuous situation you're dealing with right now. That's got you going back and forth juggling. Possibly you feel like you're... Your finances are running low because you're having to pay for court fees or having to keep going to court or having to keep trying to get things established so that you can keep the custody of your children. We got the six of cups right here. I feel like, you know, some past situation when it came to a lover, because the lover's card is right next to it, is something that... It, it gives you nostalgia. Maybe this is a person that you want to have a new beginning with. Somebody that you want to be a part of your family. Maybe you want a blended family now. I feel like you might even be holding on to their energy. Or they might be holding on to you. What's this for, this? Yeah. The Warrior of Scarabs. Somebody wants to bring in one of these. <sighs> Even though they're holding back, they still want to offer. Whoever this is, I send this energy. I don't know if it's you, if you're the um, the male that's watching, or if you're a, f a female that's watching. But somebody, it could be the male energy that wants to bring in some offer to someone. So, Taurus, if you're the king of this, you want to offer something to someone to get uh, established establishment going what's this king of this i feel like that's your energy the king of this yeah somebody wants to propose somebody wants to marry somebody the four of scepters just came out but this person feel like they're gonna be like either they're gonna be stuck not being able to make this happen or somebody feels like <sighs> They got to continue to keep on putting in some type of effort. Yeah, see, we got the four of scepters at the bottom. So it's like somebody need this last wand so that they can build and make this three into a four. Hmm. So either you're waiting on somebody's response 
or somebody might be, or they're going to be waiting on your response. Whenever this happens, whenever somebody decides to offer this proposal, because I feel like it is, because it's like the <clears throat> the king of this and then the warrior of scarabs is someone's like offering. What is this ace of wands? Somebody wants some type of union, some type of marriage. Yeah, I'm on Ra. Someone wants to be a father to uh, um, a family. Like, they want whoever their past person was or past lover. Possibly this was like a break that they separated for years. This person had a family outside of them. And now they're coming back because they want something to be justified. The judgment card keep coming out. So... Maybe this person is going to help them with their court case or be a part of their court case. This new beginning. Maybe they're they're going to be able to help them kind of have this escape. I feel like somebody wants to just have somebody with them while they go through this these trials and these um, having to work on becoming the uh, pharaoh because i feel like right now they're on their er the verge of being a pharaoh but they're having trouble with their finances and also trying to get the custody of their children so it's a lot going on but this is a father as well so what is the six of swords mm -hmm, it is oh okay the mother so whoever the mother is because moot is the emperor's card this is the person that they're trying to escape from yeah because see the six unks that came out and it came out right on the six of cups they've known this person for a long time but it's like <sighs> i'm saying this two different ways the past person they want to escape from them that they've known for a long time and this other person that they know for a long time that was a past lover they want to go towards this person because they feel like this could be a healing situation and also be something that can be unconditional love they want to bring this family together so they feel like this older person is the imp the true empress compared to their past person that came off as the empress or the person that they felt was and they had a family with them this person was juggling maybe maybe they they were juggling both people at one point and the other person left what's this two of this and now they want to come back to him yeah the eight of um scepters just fell out they feel like this person their wish the nine of onks They want to communicate. They want to balance things out. They want things to be tempered off. They don't want to have an argument. They don't want to have any type of um, disagreement. Never had high priestess energy. So I feel like this person is trying to use their intuition on how to approach a situation, especially if there's somebody that they had in the past. But maybe this person called karma on them too because the judgment card can mean karma. Maybe somebody called karma on it and it's preventing them to get this wish or preventing them to get this new beginning with this past person because of what they did with the person they're currently with or the person that they just recently broke up with so that they can get the custody of their kids what is the six of cups ten of scepters that is a lot yeah this past situation keeps this person up at night. Whatever this past person was, whoever this past person was, they really desire this person, the lover's card. But for some reason, they ch chose to be with someone else, and now it's like it's a burden for them because they want to be with the person that they left. What is the lover's card? So Taurus, I don't know if it was a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, but this Queen of Unks just showed up, and then the Nine of Unks showed up again, which is the Ten. So do you feel like this Cancer, Sp Pisces, Scorpio is your lover? Could also have Gemini in their chart, or you might have Gemini in your chart, but you feel like this person is a very loving, compassionate person. 
and you want them in your life or it could be the other way around this water sign wants you in their, their life and they want to cr create a family a unit with you but i don't know how you feel about that because see there's a 10 again a 10 of unks right there but that is what i have for y'all i hope you enjoyed it taurus if you did please don't forget to like comment subscribe share hit the post notification bell appreciate the energy exchange till next time talk to y'all later deuces